Hello angels, starlight and welcome. So this is going to be a channeled message reading and if this situation does not apply to you, please go and check my other videos because I'm gonna do a few of this and I hope the story resonates with you, okay? So let's see, what is the channeled message for this group over here? By the way, I have urgent message for all zodiac signs, and please be mindful to check more of your rising and moon also. Let's see. What is the channel message over here? We already have a card in, okay? A moon card, okay. What is the channel message over here? Okay. Let's see, we have Friend card, okay. And almostly the hangman wanted to come out, okay. Yes, hangman, okay. Let's clarify the moon card to see what's the message, okay. Nine of Swords, there was a worry, someone was worried about a certain confusion. Okay, so, let's see. Then we have the Tower, shocking events are coming, things that... that you expected to happen, and we have Six of Swords over here trying to come out. And I do really guess that someone back in the day told you about this. Because I do really feel that this is a past situation. And the strength is more of a now. Okay. Let's see. Strength is more of a now. Eight of Wands trying to come out. Someone is planning a travel and like a change is coming, definitely. And releasing a burden. That's why the hangman c came out. Because you've released a burden. Okay? Let me pull a few cards. This is like a very great, yes. A very great transformation for someone out there according to luck, money, prosperity, and a serious relationship actually is coming on your way. Okay, so yes, yes, this is going to be definitely a new person, new love so coming towards you that is highly divinely meant to be with you, okay. So let me put it like this so you can see everything and I'm about to start. So what I can see so far with the moon is like there was a situation where you were in total completely confusion state. I feel that someone did not clearly communicate their emotions and they did not speak loudly what they want from you do they want something serious is this where, where is this going to go it was like never communicated beyond and someone was not really honest with their feelings and that's why we have this nine of swords over here this caused a lot of conflicts a lot of confusion kept you up up at night like thinking why is this happening you know why is this person have seen my message and they did not respond back where are they i i'm sensing right now that someone did not answer your calls and like there was certain kind of disturbedness for you definitely but it the thing is that there was nothing wrong with you the wrong was this person because there was another person involved and you know i really feel that this was someone that you really liked and 
really like with this seven of cups that we have is like this was like a dream person they fulfilled most of the things that you were looking for in a partner but there were things that they were hiding that's why they caused a lot of confusion and there was a side person for sure even though like for for one group watching this i am sensing that this person emotionally was holding on to someone else and they were not telling the truth and for others they were really, really someone in the background maybe from work okay and then you had this tower moment where it's like it was revealed to you the truth that truth you didn't like and it got you into a certain situation where you really felt lost because you really told that this might be your person but it was not okay so I am seeing that whoever is this person it was not ready for relationship for sure and I see that your angels removed it from removed you from this so you you have to gain your confidence back that's why we have this string card the confidence the power that you have you you, you had to be like more about yourself okay and with the knight of pentacles is like for you to find a certain balance because pentacles is always balanced and it was a test for you to get out of this hermit hanged man you know this situation where you're stuck and thinking why this happened to me what i did to this person okay i didn't deserve this but your angels knows what what is the best for you and they removed it so you can go forward and work on your money and career and with the strength card and we had the eight of wands trying to come out i really feel that travel is coming like a very very huge travel and that travel the place that you are about to go in is about to help you to release because we have this ten of wands over here this ten of wands is speaking about releasing a burden something that was deep inside in your heart and i do really feel that this thing is connected to a certain drama i'm sorry trauma trauma that you had in a very deep state in yourself that you never never really thought there is there okay because it was on a subconscious level and the place that you're about to go is about to help you release this kind of burden and then for you to evolve this is a process that your angels wanted you to go through and as you can see with the nine of wands it's like someone is setting free things that are not theirs in this way you are setting free a certain mindset and things that you were taught but by your family because this is your family someone can have a life path number one i see over here because they have very huge karmatic problematic karma that they have to deal in this lifetime and i see that you are about to release a certain burden according to family family line and to get rid of a certain karma that is causing in the family line that that's why you're in this family line to to help them to release A very huge generational 
think, okay? I'm sensing here life path number one, life path number seven. And it's like from now on, you're about to be only about yourself and you're about to get a certain popularity, okay? And at, at first I feel like things will happen in a very slow way, but this is a confirmation that things will evolve into a very, very happy state and you will renew the connection with your higher self. This is what I'm hearing. Also over here, we have the Wheel of Fortune and a fate surprise is about to be given to you, okay? I don't know why I see a little child that is around someone of you it's like someone is about to send you a message through this little child okay it could be a loved one or your angels wanting you to know something but definitely with the 10 over here and with the 10 closing a huge cycle and entering a very very happy and abundant time maybe someone is going from Rahu to Kato Mahadasha in Vedic Astrology and you're entering into a beautiful state full with surprises because after that we have ten of pentacles you're about to stabilize yourself according to money finances abundance okay i see someone also having the desire to get a home or a certain place to live okay some contract can be done because we have also the justice i see that someone is about to get um how i say this give me a second someone is about to get a passport in a foreign country this could also mean that you're about to meet someone online get into a very serious marriage like relationship this is, I'm speaking now further in the future, like further, 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 because justice also can mean marriage. And it could also mean that someone can get a person that is a foreign, okay? But I am sensing that there is a new person coming towards you, more of an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and one in rising, okay? At first, I feel that you will be really back off because of your previous experience but this person will melt the ice inside of you this is what i'm sensing and before they come i feel that you will get highly spiritual and you'll be really in touch with your intuition and your angels are about to send you signs about this person when is this person going to come and when i told you that this is highly divinely connection this is what i mean because we have the nine of pentacles you gain your confidence you will start to date again but you will not get into a very serious like relationship you will just be like a little bit exploring and these are your angels confirming that a certain wish and dream is about to come true during Virgo season, which Virgo season is in September, okay? And in the back, we have the King of Swords. Definitely highly divine connection, a person that you are meant to be and definitely get involved into a marriage-like situation. So you're about to release a certain thing that no longer serves you during this eclipse season you are about to evolve you are about to glow you are about to feel confident in your skin and you are about to have an like amazing falling in love moment with this new lover and also the number 14 is going to be very important for this for some of you this is what i'm sensing right now and yeah guys this is all i have for you thank you so much for being here if you'd like to have any personal reading with me all the information is about to be down below i will also link you my instagram and tiktok so you can follow me there to see more my more daily messages thank you